Hey everybody, Dwayne from DwayneKilborn.com here and I have a quick little feedback on a slightly different tone some good old Cycor C4 Extreme now This happens to be the pink lemonade uh, flavor They have lots of great flavors of course and going back a ways I actually had uh, used a C4 quite extensively or at least exclusively after I decided I didn't like Jack 3D anymore and Jack 3D kind of lost its effectiveness after taking some time off of pre-workout supplements and then going back to Jack 3D didn't work the way I liked it to so I started looking for some other products and C4 is what I came across bang for the buck very good value not overly expensive when compared to some of the other supplements including my favorite M5 so definitely something that if you're looking to kind of just spend a little bit of money within a budget definitely something you want to take a look at however in my case I happen to have some of this lying around but uh, of course I use M5 and I didn't want to go to waste and I've been sampling out to some of my friends and you know that sort of thing because I'm not here to hog it all however I will say this I was on a, a recently well a few weeks ago we were heading up to Michigan and I live in the Atlanta area and I haven't been to Michigan in about three and a half years and we got to meet up with some good old friends and family my godchildren, that sort of thing. Really good time. However, I, you know, after a long day of work, that sort of thing, I don't drink any soda, anything carbonated. I don't, I never had a Red Bull, NOS, Full Throttle, Monster, any of those kind of things. Basically, if I want caffeine and want something with a jolt, basically you're looking at something like a pre-workout. And I knew it was going to be a long drive, and I spent the, the first two hours driving, and then I got a little nap for a few hours, but I knew that the last part of the of the drive, I needed to be wide awake and ready to go. So for two reasons: one, so others can get some sleep, and also two, so that being that Michigan and Ohio area happen to be uh, slightly different weather conditions, of course, in Atlanta in the winter time, there's a good chance we're going to have some snow or some some potential black ice, and I'm pretty well equipped to to handle that, and certainly wanted to maintain my practice on those types of driving skills so I, I took the lead on that but to make sure I was ready I did actually bring along my, my C4 kept it right up in the uh, passenger seat area for me and what I did was I drove the last six hours uh, actually about six hours and I drank water all the way through because you don't want to stay hydrated it keeps, water keeps you awake uh, at least it has for me but after I knew I was going to get kind of the, to that to that point, I decided it's time to kick a little bit of this in there, and, and of course the pink lemonade is a great flavor. So, I happen to be a lemonade fan of sorts. So, definitely something I decided to try. Thankfully, it was successful because I certainly didn't have any intentions on pulling over and uh, either napping in the car with four of us in there, or you know finding a hotel and spending money that we hadn't planned on spending. We would have if we had to have safety first, but definitely something I'm really happy to say that uh, Cellucor's C4 came through for me in this situation. Again, not something that they probably intend this product to be for, but again, I don't take no-dose or Monster or anything like that, so I used to love Mountain Dew, but I've been since 1999 uh, carbonation free, so that's all the question. So in this case, C4 came through. Really appreciate uh, Cellucor's team for finding a way to put it, whatever it is in, into this that helped me uh, stay awake those last few hours. So really something if you're looking to do, you need to stay awake. I mean, maybe you're, maybe you're in college and you need to stay awake a little longer. Now, not, I am biased, of course, but I would say I'd rather take this than some monster or something else, you know, along those lines. So do a little workout and then uh, hit the books or if you're at work or whatever else so and actually bang for your buck is even better so of course consult your physicians and uh, family and friends that sort of thing but for me I would definitely spend the money on this for your uh, pick me up during the day or of course you can use Super HD but I just didn't happen to take that uh, that that day so anyways that's my opinion uh, that's, those are my thoughts again consult physician if you're looking to drink something, an energy drink to stay awake longer for whatever purpose you need to stay awake longer for, uh, or certainly for your workouts as well. 
if you need to get a boost during your workout, we certainly don't want you to pick the wrong product or, you know, um, not consult physicians with your specific medical situation. So, with that, I'd like to hear what you think. If you tried C4 or another pre-workout, maybe on a long drive or maybe studying or uh, maybe at work, that sort of thing. I know people like to do red lines and five-hour energies and everything else in the, in the middle, but really C4 is a pretty inexpensive. I mean, this is for 30 servings, $25, you're looking at less than a dollar, less than a dollar per scoop for a serving. So, I mean, you do the math, you do one serving, or even if you do two scoops, you're still going to get out of there $2 versus something else that might be $3 or $4, <clears throat> 3 or $4. So, I'd like to hear what you think. I'd uh, love to hear your story. If you happen to have a video or, an, or a comment, uh, feel free to post below. And of course, tweet me at Dwayne Kilborn um, on Facebook. You can find me at facebook.com slash fitnessfrenziedwayne. And last but not least, fitness.dwaynekilborn.com. I blog there. I'd like to hear what you think. Have a good day.